Mike Pompeo is the former Secretary of State and former CIA director. Secretary, how serious of a plot was this and how far along was it? Well, Jesse, it's great to be with you. Let me just take a second to express my condolences to the families down in Texas who lost their loved ones. Uh, we're praying for them. Uh, we can see that if you have an open southern border, uh, almost a million released into the country during the Biden administration already, uh, the greater risk that you have a national security threat come across that border. I don't know how many of those million who have already come in may be plotting something like this man in Ohio was plotting as well. It's a very real risk. It was something that we were concerned about in the Trump administration. It's one of the many reasons we were, we were diligent. We were serious about building the wall and securing our southern border. A porous open border, like Director Ray said today, presents enormous risk. And to, the FBI did a good job. They caught this one. They stopped this one. Uh, but I'm not only worried about presidents being killed or former presidents. I'm, I'm worried about every American's safety from illegal immigrants who come here with the intention to do harm, whether they are terrorists or just violent criminals as well. When you were Secretary of State under the Trump administration, did you see evidence of suspected terrorists coming across the border? Because as the affidavit clearly says, they've already smuggled Hezbollah terrorists across. Jesse, I can't say everything that I know, but I can tell you this. Um, we saw that there were those plotting and planning to use uh, the avenues of approach into the United States. So when we were tougher on the border, they knew that it would be tougher for them to get their team in. You saw that this fellow in Ohio came in on a tourist visa. Uh, we made sure, too, that we were working to as diligently we could vet anyone who was coming into our country from any place, right? So there are multiple vectors through which they can come through. They can come in at airports on a tourist visa. They can come here as students. Uh, but coming here unlawfully, coming here illegally across our southern border gives them a clandestine way to get inside of our nation. Do you think this is going to wake up Joe Biden into securing the southern border? I mean, this is an assassination plot against against 40, what was it, 43. I mean, that's that, that's about as serious as you can get. Jesse, I doubt it. <laughs> right. uh, a, a, million, a million folks coming through. I, I hope I'm wrong. I'm, I'm, I wish that I was wrong. I, I'm rooting for a strong, sovereign southern border, uh, but I haven't seen any evidence. The progressive left wants open borders. It appears that President Biden is captured by them, or at least not willing to exert any political capital inside his own party to actually secure our southern border. So, no, I, right. I, don't, I don't think this will change their border policy at all. I hope that it allow, they allow now the CBP and the FBI to do the hard work they need to do to, at the very least, try and make sure we don't have terrorists coming across. But with this many folks, this much drug activity, this many cartels, Jesse, a very difficult task. Yeah, it is. Uh, and that, that you just showed, we just showed the picture of this, of this plotter. I mean, he looks like a fool. Hopefully this wasn't one of those things where the FBI kind of coaches this guy into making this thing. But we'll, we'll just take it at face value. All right, Secretary Pompeo, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. Jesse, thanks for having me on tonight, sir. All right.